I'm not one to do equipment reviews, because I really don't feel it is the most important thing when it comes to making movies. With that being said, this is an equipment review on the Sigma 17-50mm lens. I have been using this lens for about four months now, and I do really like it. Let's set the record straight now. The equipment you have doesn't make you a better filmmaker. The equipment you have only enables you in your storytelling. First of all, we could do comparisons between other lenses and show how it holds up and whatnot, which we will do. Here is my original 18 to 50 millimeter Canon kit lens, and here is the new 17 to 50 millimeter Sigma lens. Sure, there are differences, but let me tell you what I like about the lens and how it is helping me to tell better stories. One, the lens is cheaper than the Canon equivalent, and by a good few hundred dollars, which means more cash in my pocket. Number two, I feel it is a little bit sharper than the Canon. All I have is store showroom samples, but it is something. Number three, the F2.8 constant aperture makes it much easier for me to expose my images in natural light, where there is not an abundance of light available. Still, you need to be aware of exposure, and an underexposed image is still an underexposed image. Number four, everyone I talked to said that the Tamron 17 to 50 with VC or vibration control was super popular among video folks because it really helped in having a steady shot. I feel the Sigma's optical stabilization works just fine. Great actually. So a bonus for a lens that's actually really sharper. Number five, it came with a lens shade. Not huge, but for at least photography, it helps with blocking out those lens flares. Number six, the focus ring. Like many still lenses that people use for video, a complaint is that the focus ring is a continuous ring, so it is near impossible to set focus marks and have them remain accurate without setting some specific precautions to prevent them from going off. This Sigma lens does, in fact, have a full stop focus ring. I love this. Super easy to set marks and it even has distance settings. Number seven, it is heavy. I've heard a lot of people mention that they don't like heavy lenses because it is so hard to carry around. I'm the opposite. I love a beefy lens. It makes me feel like I've got something in my hand, even if it means an extra pound or so of gear. It shaves off time I need to spend working out. As of now, I love this lens. It is great and it does help to make it easier for me to tell the stories that I want. It is my workhorse lens that for now is always on my camera. If you want to see what other equipment that I use, you can check them out on my website. Link on the screen and in the description box below. Also provide an affiliate link to the lens in the description box below. Do you have any favorite lenses that you like to use? Let me know in the comments below. Like and share this video and subscribe by clicking somewhere here on the screen. Smartphones are useful tools that are like mini computers and cameras in your pocket. A movie studio in the palm of your hand. Oh, and they make phone calls too.